What's up guys, Nerdy Noob here. Welcome to a special edition unboxing video. This is gonna be a two-part series. So uh, in this video, I'm very excited about this. This is long awaited because I've been I've had these probably for like almost a week and a half now, and I haven't unboxed them because I've been trying to figure out how I was gonna do it. But in this video, we are gonna be unboxing four of these giant Tariba crane game boxes that I got from Japan. For those of you who don't know, I got a little bit addicted to Tariba, which is a crane game app that you can play on your phone or online, and uh, I won a lot of prizes. Now, this is, I got a total of nine boxes in. These are four of the bigger ones, and then I have four more big ones and like half of a box. So I thought I would just split it up into two. So if you've seen my most recent like win video, it's, it's, this is going to be like a mixture because I think, I don't know, like it's just going to be like an assortment of different things. So we'll see how it is. There's Mac. If you guys don't know, this is my new couch. If you didn't, oh Mac. Um, if you didn't see my vlog video, you should definitely check it out and you can see all of my new furniture down here. So I thought I would just unbox these down here since I didn't want to carry the boxes up to my filming space and we're just going to do it. Mac is going to get so scared once I try to move these boxes. Okay. So first box we have is this one. This one's very light. So I feel like this one's going to be like, I don't know. This is also one of these boxes may, may have like my 20 Rila Kumas that I won. I won 17. It wasn't 20. Okay, here we go. I don't know how long Mac's gonna last in this background because he does get scared fairly easy, but we'll just check it out. All right. Oh my gosh. I wish you guys could see into this. Okay, box number one. This is my Rila Kuma. These are a bunch of Rila Kumas. How funny is that? Okay. Oh, we lost Mac. He doesn't like when I'm waving box around. This box literally has... Look at these, look at these, look at these. Okay, for those of you who, again, didn't see my win video, I got a little bit addicted to this specific plushie, and it was only because I spent hella money and got really frustrated because I couldn't get one. I walked away from it. I watched everyone else try to get this one that was like hanging and it wasn't falling. And then I went back and I, I tried again, didn't work. And then I started moving the one to the right and then I won and like, it was just, it was, this is the night that I just, this is the night when I realized like, okay, you need to stop playing this game. Like I got overly addicted to the game and I ended up winning 17 of these Rilakkuma bears. They're not even Rilakkuma. Technically these are Korilakuma, but dressed as Rilakkuma. So um, I assume between all these packages, I'm going to end up with 17 of these things. They're way bigger than I thought they were. They don't look that big in the game when you're playing it, but let's go ahead and open one of these and see what this looks like. I already plan to give a bunch of these away as gifts and then some of the extra ones I'm probably going to donate either to like they have family shelters or uh, children's hospital. Oh this is very soft. Okay so here is our Korilakuma dressed as Rilakuma and it's it is a licensed plushie. I know some of you guys have asked and it basically is so Korilakuma is the white bear and and she's in this Rilakkuma costume and there's even the zipper it doesn't actually work but it's like to signify like oh yeah it's a costume so this is a very soft plushie it's kind of funky the way that the fuzz is it's a little bit like tattered I guess um, but it is very soft I'm actually very excited about this and I have a bunch of these now so that's great but these are gonna be a few of them are gonna be gifts and then the other ones will probably be donated a lot of you guys were asking me about that what I'm gonna do with 17 of these I don't know uh, so there's that. Okay, there we go. Mac is back. You can't see him. He's right. Oh, here he comes. Again, I don't know how long. Oh, he's hiding. He's legitimately hiding. I wish you could see him right now. Can you see him? Oh, you can't see him. He's like hiding behind the cushion, but right there. Oh, there he is. Okay. Well, there he is. He's going to run away again once I open another box, but let's just go for it. So we have box number two right down here on the floor. Um, hopefully these aren't all Rila Kumas because that's not going to be a fun video. Okay, these are not. Oh, okay. Well, they're Rila Kumas, but they're not this Rila Kuma, so that's good. Uh, the other thing that I kind of got addicted to, not addicted, I was winning them in like one to two turns, so I just kept playing, but I got these body pillows. This is the Korilakuma one, 
And let's see, we got, I think I got a total of six, three in each style. Here's the three. So there's the three Corlicumas. Um, Corlicumas, is that how you say her name? I don't know, but let's go to rip one of these open. They looked a lot bigger when I was, see this one actually looked a lot bigger when I was playing it than this one, but they're actually like the same size, which is kind of interesting. So this is a body pillow and we have Corlicuma and then there should be one of these boxes, a Relicuma one that's blue. I ended up winning six of these, three of each kind because I was literally able to win them in like one turn. It was during the challenge time. I've never done that before, but like I literally like when it was new, it just like lifted up and it would fall down. So I'm gonna give one of these to Maddie and then another one to Audrey um, because it's pink and blue and Audrey loves blue and, and Maddie loves pink. So there's our core Lakuma. And then two extras right there. Um, the next one we got is, <laughs> this one I was really excited for. This is a, uh, it's a pillow, and it's of the, what do you guys call the things? Uh, I forgot what they're called. Takiyaki or something? I don't know if that's really what it's called. But it's like that fish, this is like a street food, and it's like a fish, it's a cake that's like shaped like a fish, and there's usually something in it. I don't know what's actually in it. But this is a pillow as well. This is very fluffy. I like this. I like this a lot. I thought these would be kind of cool like couch pillows instead of like a regular couch pillow. Like how cool is that? That's like super cool. I'm excited for that one. I don't care what anyone says. Next we got this Snoopy. It's so funny like I guess my viewpoint of like how big these prizes were going to be is a, was a little bit off because I definitely thought the Snoopy was going to be bigger. There was two variants of the Snoopy. I got the rainbow one with the black ears. There was one that was rainbow, all rainbow with rainbow ears. Um, again, all of these products are licensed. Yeah, all of these have like the tags on them or whatever. But uh, this plushie is not as cool as I thought it was going to be. I'll be honest. It's soft, but it's it's a little bit more. This one's a little bit more cheap feeling, if we're being honest. I just think that um, some of the other plushies that I've received from Tereba Ter or Tereba have been a little bit nicer. But that was not terrible. It's just not the best. Oh. I'm really excited for this one. This next prize that we won is this cat. I don't know if this is a pillow technically, but it's this like Asian, you know like the cats that you can like at Chinatown and they have things that they wave their arm? It's kind of like that. Um, I need to fluff them up a little bit, but it's like a cat pillow. And it's this guy right here. I don't know what brand this is. It's some kind of Japanese brand, of course. But look at that. I thought, see, this is a cool little, like, another little pillow thing that you can put on your couch. Right? This is cool. All right, the next we have, oh. I probably spent too much money on this duck. I think this is the one that cost me a lot of money. But I really, really liked this duck a lot, and I couldn't help myself. So let's go ahead and open this up. This one definitely needs to be plumped up a little bit. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Whoa. So this is a little duck. Here's the tag. Um, this is one of those ones that you have to like, it's supposed to be not flat. It's supposed to be plumpy. So you hit it like this a little bit. You like fluff it up a little bit. Look at his big beak nose. <laughs> oh, you guys, I love this so much. I love this so much. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Look at this little plumpy, I th is this a duck or chicken? I don't know, I think it might be a baby chicken. I don't know, but look how cute this is. This is super cute. I'm so excited, yes. See, these can be pillows, like I need a pillow on the sofa. Oh yeah, oh yeah, definitely, definitely. Okay, so that was box number two. <gasps> Ooh, oh, all oh, my Rila Kumas are falling down. Okay, let's do box number three. This one's very heavy, so I don't know what's in this. And if it's a bunch of the Rila Kumas plushies, then we won't take everything out. Nope, it's not. This has some random things. I'm kind of interested to know if like one of those boxes is all Rila Kumas. But, all right, first plushie we got. I want a couple of these. Um, I got these from the ping pong game. I don't even know what the name of half of these things are, but this is the bunny thing that has the really big ears. And I got, literally I got a few of these from the, um, from the ping pong game machine. So this is the tag that it came with. And this is a plumpy rabbit. 
He's soft. He's squishy. This is a good pillow. Like these are good for the sofa. These are good for the sofa. And in, in the in the game, they kept tying the ears like this. Well, I don't know how they tied them, but they had them tied. They had them like tied up or something. But look at this bunny. This white bunny with really big ears. Oh. People say I don't need these. Look at this. Yes. I'm so excited. Okay, I'm not gonna leave all of these down here, obviously, because that would be weird. But I'm gonna have more sofas upstairs, so I can put like some of these on each one. Oh, they're so comfortable. They're like pillows, you guys. Okay, this is the uh, panda pillow that I actually won for my sister. I probably shouldn't open it, but I'm gonna sh open it to show you, and then I will give it to her. This thing took me forever to win. I, I think I ended up winning this on a ping pong game machine, but this is, oh, she's gonna love this. This is so cool. This is a panda pillow, and it's a square pillow. Here, look at this cute tag. Oh my God, my sister is gonna die. She's gonna love this. So this is a cube, and it's a pillow, and it's a panda, and she's gonna absolutely love this. I literally, it's super soft. It's like, it's very fuzzy if you can see the material. This one's very soft and, and fuzzy. Plushy, I don't know what you'd call it. It's furry, oh, it's like fleecy. Oh, okay, she's gonna love that. She's gonna love that. That's gonna be her favorite. We got another bunny, so this is a duplicate. I, like I said, I won. This is the one, this is the one that I got from the ping pong game machine that it would always pick up two balls and drop it. So I won a bunch of these. So this is a white, another white version. And actually, the next thing I have is the uh, pink version of this. Yes. So same concept. This one's a little bit more. Well, I guess they're the same. This is the pink version of the bunny with the long ears. So here's that. Same tag, same company. Very, very squishy, very plump. These are really good little pillows, you guys. I like these, I'm so excited. I hope I don't become, I'm gonna become one of those like people that just has a bunch of stuffed animals on their sofa, that's okay. Okay, next we have this bear. Uh, I'm not gonna take this one out of the bag. But this is the blushing bear, and this is just a stuffed animal, so it's not a pillow. It's just a stuffed animal. I like how soft it is on the outside. It's a little bit plump, so it's it's more of like a hard stuffed animal. Not hard, but like, it's a stuffed animal, but it's a bear. That's very cool. You got another pink rabbit with big ears. I might have to give my goddaughter some of those. Oh, yes! Do you know how long it took me to win this thing? Is this the one? There's a couple variants of this one. So this is the one that has two of them. There was like a unicorn and then, I see now I'm drawing a blank, and then another one. Or this could be just the one that was just a unicorn. There was a giraffe and a unicorn one and then there was just the unicorn one. I don't know if this one's one of those. This bag came in way thicker. I think they tried to suck the air out, but let's go ahead and open this one. This is a lot of stuffed animals, you guys. This is not great, but it's great. It's great. Okay, so we have this unicorn. This is a, I would say this is more of a stuffed animal. Um, again, I don't know if this is the one, I think this is just the one that's just the unicorn. This one took me a while to win. I don't even remember which game I won it on. Uh, there was another one that had a unicorn and a giraffe. And I, I, that should be in one of these boxes as well where I won both of these. But look at this unicorn, it's huge. This one is giant. Giant, this is very cool. I like this one. I might have to give this one away though, but hopefully not, but maybe, I might, we'll see. I know in my mind that this is terrible, but I'm so excited. Okay, last box for this unboxing. Um, this might be full of Rila Kumas, I don't know. Let's see, ooh, I didn't do a good job of opening this one. No, this one has a bunch of them. So, so maybe the last boxes I have are gonna be all Rila Kumas, I don't know, because I have 17 of them. So though, that unboxing might not be as fun, but this one looks like it's gonna be fun. Should I save this one? I feel like I should save this one. Oh, I don't know, you guys. Should I save this one for the next video? Because I'm a little bit worried that one of these boxes is just gonna have a bunch of Rila Kumas and then like my next video is gonna be super boring. I'm so excited though. I'm looking at these ones. I'm so, I'm so excited. Okay, wait, hold on one second. You know what? I'm not even gonna try to like, play God or anything. My next video might be all Rila Kumas, but I guess if that's what it is, that's what it is. There's nothing we can do about it. So let's do this last box, because I'm pretty excited about it. The first um, thing that we got is this fluffy cat. 
Oh, this is another one that's very similar to, it's really similar to the koala that I got in the last time, but kind of like the bunny, but a little bit softer. Um, this is a fun little cat. It's, it's yellow and it has a tail. And I think I got both of them. I think there was two in this set. I think there was a white one and this yellow one. Oh, he's fluffy. I like that. The next thing we got is the Rilakkuma plushie. I'm not going to open this one, but this one is Rilakkuma with a toast head. And this is just your average stuffed animal. So it's not like a pillow stuffed animal. It's just a regular stuffed animal. But yeah, it's like Rilakkuma with a toast head. Ah, we got Stitch. This was another one that I got during this the challenge time, I want to say. This one's, this one's a little bit like the Snoopy one where I feel like it's not as cool as I thought it was going to be, to be honest. I don't like the material, like the outside material, but this is a licensed Disney product, and we have our stitch. It's it's like a stuff, it's like a normal stuffed animal, but I'm not a fan of the um, material on the outside. It's it feels like thin, like a little bit cheap. But there's our stitch doll. That's really cool. I might give this one to my sister as well. She really likes stitch a lot. What is happening right now, you guys? Okay. Next, we got a Pokemon plushie. Is this? Gengar. I'm actually, I, you know, I'm not going to open, this is a banned Presto item, first of all, so that's really cool. But I'm also not going to open this one, only because I feel like this would actually make a really good gift, so I'm going to hang tight. Um, the, the Pokemon plushies are a little bit hard, so this one's a little bit plump. It's kind of hard, uh, but it's okay. I think it was the Ditto one that I liked more in this set, I want to say. But that's a cool one, and it has a little string you can hang. Okay, this is the plushie that I worked so hard to get, so I'm definitely going to open this one. This is really hard. I wish this one was soft and fluffy, um, but this is that beaver that's eating the rice triangle. I wanted this so badly, and I played for such a long time to get this. There's also like a little fox one that also eats the rice triangle, but look how cute this one is. This one's not as soft as I would want. It's very, it's a hard plushie, and the outside is, is very, uh, like, Feltish. It's not feltish. It's soft, but it's like feels it's not as nice as some of the other ones But I do like Just it's a beaver eating a rice triangle. So that's great I'm looking around right now going what am I doing with my life, but I'm still excited about it uh, This is a Mickey plushie. It's like a classic Mickey plushie. I'll probably give this on away as a gift to this is Just it's again. It's not as soft as some of the other ones, but it's like a plushie. It's like a stuffed animal plushie um, there's your little tag down there. I don't, I didn't really actually like the color scheme of this one. I think I won this one in like a ping pong machine. Whatever I did, it was easy. And I just remember like, okay, well, I'll just win it anyways. Oh, next we have, oh, this is our, is this our Winnie the Pooh bear? Yeah, so we got this Winnie the Pooh plushie. I guess I could take this one out of the bag. This one's soft. This one's nice. pretty big. I won this one in a few tries. It's not as um, stuffed as I probably would want it to be, although I feel like the arms probably aren't as stuffed because it's supposed to be a laying down plushie, but I like the color scheme. It's kind of classic, like really pastel-y, and then there's the tag on his butt. So there's the Winnie the Pooh. And then we got, the last ones that we got are these two Rilakkumas. Are these the same? Yes. So these are the same, so I'm only gonna open one. This is now different though than the Rilakkuma or the Korlakuma dressed as the Rilakkuma. This is a, a fatter, fluffier stuff plushie. This one's big and heavy. Okay, so this is just a stuffed animal, um, but it's big. This is cool. His head's a little bit harder than his body. I like this. I like the fuzziness one. I like the fuzziness of this one better than I like the one that I got 17 of. Um, but yeah, there you go. Okay. Oh, you guys. Okay, well, that was part one of my Tariba Mega Unboxing because I have five more boxes that I need to do. Um, the first set that I shipped out was like 47 prizes, so there's definitely a lot on their way. I do have a lot of duplicates though, so I'm gonna figure out either gifting or um, donating. I know a lot of you guys have said donating, which I'm totally for. I just wanna find the right organization to donate to. So I'm actually really excited about this cat too. This, this yellow cat, well, this one, it's very squishy, and I'm totally gonna keep this. I don't know why I didn't want to take this one out of the bag. This reminds me of the of the koala one that I have over there. Oh yes, yes. Okay, 
I don't know which one's my favorite, you guys. I love the ones that are like this, that are plumped and squishy, like the duck and the cat and the bunnies. Um, I also like the takiyaki or whatever it's called, the fish thing right here. Um, I am a little bit disappointed at how hard the beaver is. Uh, the unicorn's cool. The Snoopy one, I think, could have been a little bit, like, fancier. Um, I really like this panda pillow. My sister's gonna love that. Uh, the body pillows are a little bit disappointing. I like this cat one, but definitely these ones that are, like, fluffy and plump, these are my favorite. This one's so squishy. <gasps> oh, I love this one. I don't know why I didn't want to take it out. Oh, this one's cool. This one's so soft and squishy. Okay. That's all I have for you guys in this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, feel free to click the like button below. If you want to see more unboxing videos, go ahead and check out my channel. I have a whole bunch on there, and you should subscribe. Let me know in the comment section below what did you guys think about this unboxing. I know a lot of you guys have been talking crap about my trivia things. Like, what are you going to do with those? And you're right. I have no idea, but these are so cool. I'm so, I'm like in heaven right now, you guys. I bought a sofa just so I could win plushies from Tariba and and have the plushies all over because why not? Why freaking not is what I say. So let me know which one's your favorite out of all of these. Did anyone win any of these? I actually think this cat, surprisingly, I think might be my favorite out of this group because it's so plump and so squishy. It has that type of filling that's like really, really squishy and I love it a lot. And I think this one might be my favorite. I don't really know. I have to look around. Um, but yeah, let me know all of your thoughts down below. Don't forget, if you subscribe to my channel and your subscriptions aren't blocked or set to private, you'll make it onto my thank you to subscribers page, which is coming up shortly. Before we go, we must do the video shout out. I don't know where my phone is. Oh, it's in my pocket. Oh my gosh, you guys. <sighs> what is happening in my life? It's like weird because I, I like question it, but then I'm like, this is so cool. Like, this is so cool. Today's video shout out is going to go to... All right, I'm giving it to Litzy's Delight. Litzy has been... Lizzie's Delight has been following me on YouTube forever and you recently commented on one of my Treba videos asking, what am I going to do with all those really kumas? And you're right. I don't know. There's a lot of... I, I won 17 of these things, which will probably be my next unboxing. How many did I unbox in this video? There's four or five, four? I don't know, so be on the lookout for way more. But yeah, let's see, you're right, I don't know. I don't know what's happening. I'm looking around and I just, I'm just very excited for this plumpy cat and this duck and these bunnies and just, I don't even know. I don't know, but let's see, thank you so much for like literally just supporting my channel for so long. I really do appreciate it and I just want to give you the video shout out. So, shout out to you, Litzy's Delight. Shout out to you. All right, guys. Well, I hope you have an amazing day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.